Hello everyone, it's your girl me Viva and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to my get together Let's play. This is part 39. So we only have one more part to go and then this let's play will be over in case y'all forgot but don't be sad because like i said this is not the last of seeing these sims we definitely will see them in the future but i can't tell you how soon or how far away that would be because like i said it all depends on what content we get for the game in the future depending if doing a let's play what did i just say that would determine if i do a let's play with these sims of what type of expansion pack or game pack or whatever comes out so what's happening right now the kids are playing don't wake the llama chanel malachi and xavian what happened last part is camille and Cree gave birth to both xavian and chanel so yeah that happened and i don't remember because it's been a while so i don't know but what we're gonna be doing this part is gonna be kind of a special part it might be actually a shorter part because um all the other stuff that i want to do might happen in the last part it may be be a shorter part because all the stuff that I want to do may happen in the last part so what we're gonna be doing today as you can see I'm focusing on Ryan right now he has a task that he wants to get done tonight and that is he wants his babies his kids his triplets Tay Trinity and Trey to meet the special woman in his life at the moment which is Kiana because this is it's not Ryan's first girlfriend we're gonna say he had girlfriends in the past but then he realized that relationships weren't for him and he was just settling with being a f boy but now he's actually being serious by being in a relationship with Kiana because he's gotten over those ways and he's ready to you know mature because he's getting older he's an adult now and uh he wanted his kids to meet Kiana because he do plan on being with Kiana for a while not really sure if he's going to marry Kiana as of now but he definitely is very serious about Kiana and he wants them to meet and hopefully they will get along well so what we're going to be doing we're going to have Ryan to take Kiana and the triplets out to a restaurant because you know Diana just came out so you're going to see me going to restaurants a lot because it's fun it's cool and it's so many different restaurants on the gallery like you can't get bored with it because each restaurant is going to be different in the atmosphere and the food. And I think it would just be fun to finally show some gameplay of me going to a restaurant in my Let's Plays. You will see it in my other one. But uh, yeah, so Ryan, he's going to take them out to this nice Italian restaurant. I think you have to dress formally. He might change when he get there. But uh, yeah, so let's go on and go to the restaurant. So I'm going to have Ryan to travel. And he's going to have his kids meet Kiana, which is so, so important, you know. And where is his kids? His kids never want to show up. Here go Trey, Tay, and Trinity. Okay, so let's go to the restaurant. Hopefully it's working right and correctly because sometimes when you get um, restaurants off the gallery, stuff in there is placed by move objects on and then things don't really function like they supposed to. So we're going to cross our fingers and hope that the restaurant functions properly so i put a restaurant here in winterberg it's called ambrosio so just search that on the gallery and you could download it for yourself if you want to play with this restaurant too once you see me play with it so let's get on to the restaurant okay so we're here at the restaurant like i said it's called ambrosio and i think it's supposed to be like an italian restaurant the dress code is formal but Ryan showed up in his formal, but the other people, of course, in the group, they didn't show up in their formal. So I had to have Ryan to ask them to change it to their formal. But I don't know. Anyways, we're going to try to make this a fancy, nice formal dinner because it's a very important moment. But this is the restaurant. I put it in this little area of uh, Windenberry. There go our club right there, which we're going to go to. In the last part, we got to have one last Onyx Club gathering in the last part. Y'all know that. Y'all know that. Okay, so everybody is in the restaurant. Let's look at the kids. They look all nice and dressed up. Here go Tay. He looks like he's not in a good mood and he is not excited about meeting Kiana. There go Trinity. She looks like her mom and Ryan all in one. Like, that's crazy. And there go tray tray with his eyes closed there you go his eyes are open now okay so we're gonna go ahead and try 
Trinity, why are you doing sit-ups? <laughs> We're going to request a table. We'll have Ryan to request a table for them. Uh, there go the big blue guy. He's always in my gameplay somewhere. It looked like he might be on a, a little date. That might be his wife, so that's cool. Anyways, um, where do we want to sit? It's five of us. I'm not really sure if five people could sit at a booth. I don't think they can. Oh, so these seatings don't work. I probably should have checked that out before. Yeah, I don't think everybody could sit like around like this. So I only think they could sit like here. So we might end up splitting off into two separate tables. Okay, y'all. So it was going to have them separate into two different tables. But I was having Ryan to sit alone. So I, once again, edit the restaurant to put a bigger table so they all could sit together. So like I said, once you get these restaurants off the gallery, you have to edit them a bit to fix your liking for your gameplay. So stuff like that won't happen. So we're going to get this bigger table and we're all going to sit together as a family, hopefully. And we're going to order and stuff. So here's your table. Enjoy your meal. It's kind of dark in here. I should have put a candle on the table, but it's all right. So hopefully they start talking to Kiana. I wanted Ryan to be a little bit closer to her, but that's okay. He's going to flirt with her. Make sure that his kids know that this is his woman and stuff. Ryan has to use the bathroom, but it looks like everybody's having a good time. Before we order, I just want to go around and ask the kids about their day because he haven't seen them in a little while. So we're just going to do that and hopefully everybody just start talking together. <laughs> hopefully, you know. It seems like everything is going good so far. Marcus is home from work and i'm gonna have ryan to go ahead and order for the table like i said we're gonna try to order some nice food for the family okay so i'm gonna have ryan to we're gonna get a sense mapolitan for both him and kiana i don't want the triplets drinking so the closest thing that they could get that's doesn't look alcoholic it's actually coffee and water darn they should have put the spark in the water on there but i don't want them to have any coffee then eva would be upset that her kids are wired up and not going to bed we're going to just get them water i wish they could have had something a little bit better than that but it's okay should we go for like an appetizer and then like a main course or just go for a main course and then a dessert I think we're going to go for a main course and a dessert. So, ooh, we have so many good options. I think we're going to get... Ryan is going to get the lobster. We're going to get Kiana the rack of lamb. Um, We're going to... Get Trinity the herb crusted salmon and Trey could have the pasta and Tay could have this. I'm not even gonna try to say that, but that's gonna be our first meal. It's gonna come up to 174 simoleons. I'm just gonna wait for the waiter or waitress to take our order. Then I'm gonna send Ryan to the bathroom so he can use the bathroom and not pee himself. He might go to the bathroom himself. I don't know, but here she comes. She's gonna take our order. Come on, lady. Take our order. It's a cute little restaurant. It's a little dark. I should have added some light in here, but that's fine. So she's taking our order. Hopefully they don't take too long. I don't think it's that many people here, so that's okay. Can you go use the bathroom, though? He's probably not going to go. Because they're like, you need to wait for your food, but he got to pee, though. He might go on his own eventually if his bladder gets too low. So everybody just talking, having a good old time. It's not that many people here, so hopefully it goes well. You see the chef back here cooking away. He's showing off. Okay, okay, chef, Javon, okay. But I've been seeing, like, some people, like, reading the forums and Twitter. Some people have issues with dying out. I don't know why. I haven't experienced any issues yet. But sometimes they have to wait for hours and hours and hours before they get their meal or they never get it. And I'm like, I never experienced that. So hopefully I don't experience that 
doing this recording because I would be like really, really upset. It seemed like they all talking and getting along. Yeah, they all laughing. This is such a cute moment. They're actually like getting along. So I think they are liking Kiana, which is great because she could possibly be their stepmother in the future don't know <laughs> but if i do decide oh i mean see our food came fast yes that's what i like to see lady give us our food oh it looks so nice here's your order enjoy we will try to really enjoy our meal thank you so much they look like they're all excited about their meal too that's great eat now y'all eat why y'all not eating y'all talking eat okay they about to eat now but they just talking so much. Stop talking and eat, y'all. Because it's already super late. And I want y'all to have a dessert as well. So, Ryan like, ooh, this drink is good. <laughs> They're not eating, though. Eat, y'all. Maybe they shouldn't have too much conversation. Are they going to eat or no? I don't I don't know. Okay, Trey, he drinking his water. Oh, look at her. Try to be all funny with them. See, Kiana, she's going to be a good stepmother. She really is. See, she really getting along with them, and that is wonderful. Ryan got used to the bathroom so that <laughs> we're just going to speed this meal up a little bit. Seeing how everybody enjoying their meal. Let's see if we got any new moodlets. We have out to dinner from requesting a table. Where it go? From requesting a table at a restaurant. Mmm, delicious. Why I keep going away? <laughs> There's nothing like going out to a restaurant. For a big meal, those chefs could really cook. Thank you, thank you, thank you for taking our glasses. He's really filling the uh, furniture and stuff, but he got used to bathroom, so we're going to try. Trinity taking pictures of her food. Chad posted this Instagram. That's fine. Ryan really got used to bathroom, so he needs to just hurry up and finish eating. And then we're going to order a dessert and we're going to tell the kids goodbye. He's going to go to the bathroom now once he's done eating. Go to the bathroom, Ryan. Go to the bathroom, Ryan. Don't pee yourself. Don't do it. Also, in the comment section below, let me know what y'all would like to see for the last part. Like I said, this part might be just a little shorter because I really didn't know what to do in this part because I tried to think about it. I was like, I don't know. But like I said, the last part, we will probably have like a little family cookout at a park. Try to invite everybody, have some hot dogs, hamburgers, whatever. And then... We're going to have one last group outing, well, club gathering, whatever, at our own club at Club Onyx, and Ryan's going to DJ, and everybody's going to dance, and it's just going to be cool, you know? All right, so let's order some dessert. Um, Should we get another drink? Maybe we should, maybe we shouldn't. And yeah, let's have some more drinks, why not? <laughs> Let's have Tay, Trey, and Trinity have their water again. And let's get some wine or nectar, I should say, for Ryan and Kiana. They might, you know, have a little woohoo. He might take her home. Who knows? We we don't know. Okay, for dessert, we have white cake, chocolate cake, strawberry cake, lemon bar. Ooh, a lemon bar sounds good. But a baked Alaska sounds even better. Let's have... I want everybody to have something different. Let's give Kiana the Baked Alaska. Ryan will have the tiramisu. And Trinity will have the chocolate souffle. And let's see. We're going to get Trey the lemon bar. And we're going to give Tay the lava bundit cake. I don't even know how you say it. But we're going to do that. And our total bill is going to be 305 simoleons. Ryan must be... He got the bank in his pocket. <laughs> but we're going to go ahead and order dessert. Tay is not even done with his meal. But okay, now he's done. So we're going to order our dessert. And then we're going to go because it is a school night. And they need to get ready to go home and sleep a little bit and go to work. So after... Not go to work. <laughs> go to school and then um we're just gonna let them go we're gonna go home might take kiana back home with us maybe not i don't know what will happen but i need to make sure these other sims are taking care of themselves and going to bed and stuff which they probably not but that's okay i'm guessing trinity is going to the bathroom so that's totally fine 
And also, yeah, I have to show y'all um, Chanel's room. I did her room. I need to show y'all her room. So, is our dessert coming? It seemed like our main course came a lot faster than our dessert is coming. So, I don't know. I guess we'll see. Nobody's here because it's like super late. We're the only ones left because we just want some dessert. Like, that's crazy. Come on, chef. Where are our dessert at? Give it to us. He's taking way too long. Come on, man. We're the only one here. I know you got to cook like fat desserts, but... Oh, it's ready. It's right there. Was it there the whole time or it just popped up there? I didn't even see it happen. I swear I didn't. <laughs> oh, no. Trinity is sick. Give your daughter some medicine. She need to go home. She's feeling sick. Maybe it's from the food. Oh, that dessert look good, though. This is some good dessert. I wish I had it, but, you know, Ryan low-key trying to get Kiana a little, you know, tipsy, you know. <laughs> Might try to do some things for her. You you never know. Do we have any bushes around here? We should, but I'm not really sure. I can't confirm that there are bushes around. I don't think there are. That's okay, though, if it's not, you know. Like I said, we can always take her home. No, it's a bush right here. Oh, snap. We're going to be using that bush. I don't think we had bush woohoo in a long time. But we're going to send the kids home and him and Kiana. Just going to play around a little bit. And then I'll probably cut away to the next morning. So, that's what we're going to do. He need to work on another, like, mix. He haven't did a mix in a while. I feel like Ryan haven't even DJ in a while. But, you know, it's whatever. So I hope everybody had a good... Oh, she's feeling so bad. Make your child feel better, Ryan. She's feeling sick. It could have been that salmon. That salmon. They all, like, around us, like, can y'all get out? It's late. We trying to go home. Thank you. <laughs> as soon as we done, they picking up all the dishes. Thank y'all. See, like, I have no issues with my dad now, but I know some people do. Um, if you're having issues with Dan out, like I said, you might want to just check the lot because like I said, people are using move objects on when they making these restaurants and sometimes stuff like that just messes up the whole lot, especially with dining out because certain things need enough space in order to function properly. So you might just want to move like the hosting station around to somewhere with more space or the waiter station around or even the stove because this kitchen had like cabinets all around and it was no chef here because the chef technically couldn't use it because all the stuff that was around it, it didn't give it enough space so a chef could be here and cook so I had to fix that and if none of that works I'm gonna just say <laughs> Um, we're going to end the meal and pay our bill. Thank you so much. It was a lovely experience. I love this restaurant. It's cute. I just need to put a little bit more work into it. So it says the restaurant. Hope you enjoy your meal. Simoleons. Simoleons have been automatically deducted from your household. So that's cool. We're going to have Ryan to hug all his kids. Hug. I think I might have poses in my game still. So it might look weird. I don't know. We'll see. But as I was saying, if none of that works, just repair your game, and hopefully that will fix it. Hopefully. Everybody leaving. Wait, where y'all going? Ryan trying to hug y'all, and y'all just running off. I don't think he's going to do anything with Keon. And up there leaving. Well, at least you get to hug one of your kids. <laughs> They're like, we're tired. We're leaving. Bye, Trey Trey. We love you. And we're going to... um. Go ahead and disband the group, tell him goodbye if we can. I don't want to tell him just go away because I think that would be kind of rude. I swear it's like a goodbye. See, he's feeling sick. Uh, Trey is feeling sick as well, which is not great. We're just going to tell him goodbye and go back home. And we're going to cut away until the next day. Okay, y'all, so it's the next morning. I need to start getting the kids ready to go to school, but I just want to show y'all Chanel's room. So this is her bed, and I decided to go with, like, a peach, orange, white, gray theme. Just anything with orange. I really didn't know what I wanted to do with her room. She got a little TV. She got this big old dollhouse. We got to see her play with that. 
and she got her toys over here in her little loft bed which she is sleeping in currently looking so much like her freaking mother so cute and she has some little um, bean bags down there to sit there and watch TV I'm not really sure if those function or not and of course you know Camille decorated this room herself as you can see because you know Camille is obsessed with Chanel and of course we got the Chanel posters because her name is Chanel so there we go so that's her room um we need to wake her up Xavier he's sleeping over here and I I'm trying to mess around with this so that both of them could sleep at the same time but they can't right now so it's like weird you know but it's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and wake up Chanel, let her take a shower and stuff, possibly eat some cereal before she has to go to school. And we need to wake up Xavian as well. I guess he could use this bathroom because we're limited on bathrooms because I took away that bathroom to put Chanel a room. And I'm pretty sure they might have to do homework that they haven't done since I aged them up. They only have an hour before school. But that's okay. He's going to walk right through them. Yep, yep, I knew it. He's like, wake up. If I'm up, y'all got to wake up. <laughs> also, I forgot. I'm supposed to be showing the family tree. I will probably end the part with me showing the family tree because I'm not going to play too much longer. Just want y'all to see the kids get ready to go off to school and stuff. We need to mop up that puddle. Chanel, girl, you taking a long time like your mother. Hurry up and get ready. You only got like 30 minutes before you got to go to school. Malachi is up. He's ready. He's drinking his water, trying to stay hydrated. He had his cereal. He didn't sleep all night because, like I said, the whole bunk bed thing, it doesn't really work too well because it's not an official bunk bed. And I'm hoping that we will get bunk beds pretty, pretty soon. I will want that to come in a kid's stuff pack that we're supposed to be getting this month as well but i'm pretty sure we probably won't be getting any bunk beds which is very disappointing but you never know i could be wrong because we haven't seen any trailers for it just yet so please give us bunk beds please that would be such a lifesaver you know all right clean up malachi you're gonna be the first one to go Xavier, are you ready you need to come eat some cereal real quick you don't have time hurry up Xavier. Nope, he don't have time. I'm just not going to let him eat. Sorry, Korean Xavier. Your child did not get to eat because he woke up so late. And freaking Malachi, he broke <laughs> the dishwasher. Lord, these kids. Chanel, get like one or two more bites in, then you got to go. I'm sorry, baby, but you got to go to school. Your brother, he's leaving you. Oh, look at the little boat back there. So cute. So, 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 so cute. All right, go to school. Hurry up. Go. Go, 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 go. Your mom is the way she's like, is that girl still here? She better go off to school. All right, Camille. Um, What's happening? What's happening? Oh, snap. Incoming text message. Shane Reigns. You and I haven't always gotten along, but maybe we could become friends. What do you think? Breakfast at Ambrosio. I didn't even know that was a thing. So it seems that other Sims... Even Sims that you really don't know because I don't know who he is can invite you out to eat at restaurants. That's cool, but we're not going to go with you because we just went there with Ryan. So that's a cool thing to know. So in case y'all wanted to know, in case you didn't know that, um, Sims can invite you out to eat at restaurants, which I think is pretty, pretty cool. So don't mop that up right now. I'm sorry if y'all hear those ambulance outside. I don't know what is going on. Somebody... Is in an emergency state right now anyways so I'm about to end this part really really soon because like I said all the stuff that I want to do will probably happen in the last part like I said leave me some suggestions down in the comment section below but I think pretty much all I'm gonna do is have like a little family cookout and then let Onyx have one last club gathering also Onyx V2 might have a little club gathering cuz they only have one recruit member but they could play around and stuff we got mail i think in part our child support oh no it might not be child support because i don't have the mc command center mod and currently when i tell y'all my game was acting crazy before i started recording i don't even know what was going on with my game stuff is just not acting right but 
it's okay. I'm still hearing like police cars and sirens. I don't know what's going on. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna let Cree pay the bill. Then she needs to get ready. So she need to come use the bathroom and take a shower. But anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and show the family tree. I think the sirens are done now so if y'all heard it I'm so so sorry but I want to show the family tree because I never look at family trees because it doesn't go as extended as it should and it really needs an update so that's why I don't look at it I forgot where it's at honestly I think it's right here so things are not going to be linked up right and it's not going to look right so yeah so we're going to start off with uh David you know David is Camille and Cree's father and he's related to Donovan Gray. Donovan Gray is Ryan's uh, father. So you can see so um, they're brothers which is how Ryan is cousins with Camille and Cree. A lot of people got confused and thinking that Ryan is their brother. He is not their brother. He is their little cousin. <laughs> so Donovan is married to Sonia, and you know, they had Ryan together. Then Ryan had Trinity, Trey, and Tay. He's not currently married yet, and of course his kids haven't had any kids yet. So back with uh, David, David is married to Fallon, you know, that's the parents of Camille and Cree. And Camille had Malachi and Chanel, and Cree, who was married to Xavier, she had Xavier. So that's how their little tree branch off. As you can see, she's married to Marcus. Their family tree is not that big, but yeah, I'm going to try to show the family tree a lot more often. But uh, yeah, I think I'm going to end this video right here. I'm sorry if it was all over the place, but like I said, next part will be the last part, and that should be coming out in a few days. And then y'all all know once this LP ends, my Sims 3 Let's Play is going to be starting, which I still have a lot of work to do on that. So, yeah. But I think we're going to have a little family cookout. Onyx going to have a club gathering. Onyx V2 going to have a club gathering. And that's going to be it. I wish I could do a slash show, but I've really been slacking on taking screenshots. So, it's really not that many. It's not going to be like a progressive, like, that show so I'm just I'm not gonna do it sorry but um I may do a face cam for the last video so let me know if you want to see a face cam in the last part I might do it <laughs> if I'm not looking ratchet but anyways like this video up if you haven't already and subscribe to my channel if you're new follow all those links down below and I will see y'all in my next video Thank you.